بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس آئی ایم کبل زاہد یور انسٹرکٹر فار دا کورس پرنسپلس آف مائکرو اکنامکس ایکو تھری او ٹو آئی ویلکم آل آف یو ان دس کورس اینڈ ہوپ دیٹ یو ول لرن اینڈ انجوائے دس کورس ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس اکنامکس از ویری انٹرسٹنگ سبجیکٹ It is basically about the study of economy. As a human being, we want to have a lot of things, but we have very limited resources to satisfy our wants. For example, we want to have food, we want to have houses, clothing, books, furniture, telephones, medicines, etc. But we have limited income or limited resources to satisfy all these wants same happens in case of an economy so economics is the subject which studies how society uses its limited or scarce resources in order to satisfy unlimited wants Economics is broadly categorized into two main branches which are microeconomics and macroeconomics micro means small or minute object so microeconomics is the branch of economics which deals with the behavior of small units of the economy or individual units of the economy like the farm the industries the household the market for individual goods and services etc now macroeconomics as the name indicates macro means large in scope or extent so macroeconomics is the branch of economics which deals with the economy as a whole in this course principles of microeconomics we will study all the basic and core concepts of microeconomics we will start with the discussion of nature and importance of microeconomics basic problems of microeconomics and discussion about different economic systems ye sab issues hum isme padhenge then we will study the theory of consumer behavior utility theory of consumer behaviors indifference curve analysis consumer equilibrium income effect substitution effect and price effect ye sab wo concepts hain jo hum theory of consumer behavior mein cover karenge inshallah after studying the theory of consumer behavior we will move towards the theory of production cost and revenues in this we will discuss the concepts like production function isocont and isocost curves marginal rate of technical substitution the cost and revenues of the farm after this we will study theory of farm behavior and market organization we will deeply discuss different market structures like perfect competition monopoly and oligopoly in this at the end of this course we will study pricing and employment resources modern theory of resource pricing input demand curve of farm and supply curve of resources ye sab wo concepts hain jo hum isme discuss karenge so dear student ye sare topics جو ابھی ہم نے ڈسکس کیے ہیں وہ ہم وی ول کور دیم ان شاء اللہ ان اے سیریز آف ففٹین آڈیو لیکچرس ایٹ دا اینڈ آف دس کورس اسٹوڈینٹس شوڈ بی ایبل ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ اینڈ ڈسکس بیسک کانسیپٹس آف مائکرو اکنامکس ٹاٹ ان دس کورس اینڈ شوڈ بی ایبل ٹو اپلائی دیز مائکرو اکنامک کانسیپٹس یوزڈ ان نیوز میڈیا ڈبیٹس اوور ایشوز and in daily conversation as i have already told you that 
there will be 15 audio lectures for this course. There will be no lecture handouts for this course. PowerPoint slides of each lecture will be available on VULMS site. So, you are required to focus on the lecture contents, PowerPoint slides and recommended books for this course. Let's discuss the recommended books for this course. The textbook for this course is Economic Theory, Volume 1 by Dr. Mohammed Hussain Chaudhry. As this is textbook for this course, so we will focus mainly on this book. For further guidance, you can study reference books for this course, which are Microeconomic Theory, 6th edition by Ferguson and Gould. Number 2, Microeconomics by Robert S. Pendick and Daniel L. Robinfeld. Number 3, Fundamentals of Economics, Part 1 by Habibullah Wasir. Students, you have two interfaces to communicate with your instructor. That is via Moderated Discussion Board, MDB, or via email. If you have any query related to the course content, you are most welcome to ask on Moderated Discussion Board. Aapko koi bhi concept samaj nahi aara, agar koi problem hai related to the contents of the course, just post your question on MDB. I am always here to help and assist you in this regard. Apart from MDB interface, there is an other interface to report general issues. For example, if you have any issue regarding course activities, you can contact me through email. Email address for this course is eco302 at the rate of vu dot edu dot pk. कोई भी general issue हो जो आप discuss करना चाहते हो, report करना चाहते हो, you can send email on eco302 at the rate of vu.edu.pk. I will be here to reply your emails, inshallah. At the end of introduction, I would like to brief about the weighted activities for this course which are assignments, graded discussion board, quizzes, midterm exams and final term exam. Assignments, GDBs and quizzes will be given to you during semester, whereas midterm exam will be held after 8 lectures and final term exam will be held after completion of 15 lectures. So, dear student, this is all about introduction for this course.